Hi, this is going to be a series of tips on using my laser sheets. The first one is a ruffle fern and before you do anything with it, remove the uh, fern from the, uh, the paper at the connection. Then the next thing that I do is puddle out uh, some white glue. Then I run my wire through the white glue and wipe off the excess and place it down the center of the fern. Okay, then I let that dry. I'm going to paint it. I usually use like a seminal green ceram coat uh, and a leaf green when I paint. So mainly just lay the color in, then go back and do highlights later with some yellow and brown washes or inks. Now when the the fern is dry, good and dry, you take your fern and kind of rough it up a little bit. Just remember this is just paper and then you can give it some shape. You can either put this in with the uh, wire up so that it looks more like the stem or with the wire down. It's just a really a, a preference as to what uh, you would like to do with it. But be sure and give them a little bit of roughing up so that they have some dimension. Okay then when you, you can plant them in a pot put them in an arrangement, in a landscape. You'd also want some fiddleheads, the um, new growth for fern. Okay, this is the fiddlehead, the new growth on the fern. Um, to make it, all you do is curl the 30 gra gauge wire, um, put some white glue on it and then the flock. Now when I put flock on I have it in a little bottle and hold it over a cup and drop it on to the to the glue. That way it will make it look like it's standing up a little bit more. Okay, and that's the end of making ferns. I hope you will try some other things. Thank you.